This comment is really about what if I have a medical condition and the officer says, I'm supposed to have to need to complete these field sobriety tests, or you have a medical condition and you do these field sobriety tests anyway. The National Highway and Traffic Safety Administration has tested the field sobriety test, that is the horizontal gaze astagmus test or the eye test, the walk and turn test, and the one leg stand test on a specific field of volunteers. Those volunteers that they tested their field sobriety test on were generally in good health, not obese by the CDC standard, and under the age of 65. What does that mean for you? Whether it be for your spine, your knees, your feet, your hips, when you have a medical condition that can be proven with doctor testimony or medical records, then those field sobriety tests, especially the walk and turn and the one leg stand test, could be invalidated at trial because the National Highway and Traffic Safety Administration did not validate their field sobriety test, that's their horizontal gaze astigmas test, the walk and turn test, and the one leg stand test on people with medical conditions like feet, hips, knees, back, people over 65, and people that are considered obese by the CDC. Thank you for watching this video. We've grown so much and we're now looking to get to 10,000 subscribers. If you enjoyed this content, make sure that you hit the subscribe button below and to make sure that you see more content from me and channels like me, you ring the bell and click the like button below.